if we have any sort of winter storm, the heat pumps are screwed with to no end because they will freeze over on the top. The blades will freeze in place. Like in between cycles or during a defrost cycle, they'll freeze in place. And because it's not really when the blade is turning, because when the blade is turning, you know, you hear the tick, 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 it'll break ice off. But with the blade stops and it gets frozen into place, there's not enough starting torque in that motor with that little run capacitor to break it out of that ice. It just can't do it. It's not strong enough to do it, at least not with starting torque. It couldn't do it. If it was spinning, you know, it would be a different story. But it happens all the time here whenever we have the ice storm. The ice storm. Any ice storm. If we have any ice storm at all, it's frantic here. Completely frantic. But it's a common problem. We get a lot of bent blades, a lot of ice falling on stuff. Back in the day, my dad would say, if we're setting a unit, let's keep it out of the drip line. And sometimes that would take us like 18, 24 inches off of the house. People be like, you setting that too far from the house. The reason why that is, is you can get out of the drip line and you can avoid issues like that.